This is example nine. Um, so say we had a hollow conducting sphere. There's the outside. There's the inside. They're concentric, so it's everything's centered, even though it's not drawn that way. And then we have in the middle a charge of plus Q. Okay. And the question is what happens? What happens to the inside surface and what happens to the outside surface? So the electric field uh, due to that charge Q is equal to 1 over 4 pi epsilon naught Q over R squared in the R hat direction. Now, the electric field on the inside of the sphere, however, however has to be zero. So the charge it accumulates on this inside surface has to exactly cancel that out. Now we know that the charge for a, 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 a shell is the same as the charge for a point. So E of the inside has to equal one over four pi epsilon naught and cancel it out with a minus Q over R squared over R hat, right? So um, this inside shell has a charge of minus Q and uh, dividing by um, dividing by the um, surface area there, we're going to get a sigma. So sigma inside is equal to minus Q over 4 pi, and the radius on the inside is A squared. Okay. So we have a bunch of negative charges dancing around. Um, on the surface there, not dancing, they're just they're stationary. Everything's electrostatic, right? Now, because this um, this sphere does not have a net charge, we have to have a positive charge on the other surface. So, F two plus is all over here, and it has to be exactly opposite to to the charge on the inside. So, sigma outside is minus or plus q over four pi b squared. Okay. Now, as you remember, the, the charge, the electric field due to these charges um, are zero on the inside. So this surface charge doesn't contribute anything to the conductor on the inside. So it's just this guy and this guy canceling each other out. Whereas the, um, the charge outside the sphere looks like a point charge with a charge of plus q, which is exactly what we have in the center. So in a way, outside the sphere, you know, the nothing different is happening. It's as if the sphere wasn't even there, which is kind of curious. So interesting.